Hi guys, Charlie here again. Uh, just doing a quick video today. I want to talk about something that helped me back at the beginning of my journey um, into um, being a business owner and uh, an online marketer. Um, it was confidence. Confidence was uh, the main setback for me and from a lot of people that I connect with and talk to on, on social media now. Um, it's something that held them back or is still holding them back in doing things like publishing online. Um, doing YouTube videos, starting our own YouTube channel, starting our own blogs, uh, posting content. All of it seems to come down to this one factor is, is the confidence um, and believing in yourself that you can do it. Um, a lot of it I find is worrying about what people think when you do it. Um, you know, saying, uh, let's talk about videos for instance, you know, posting a video um, like this. Um, you know you, you got to start somewhere and that's the thing and what one of the quotes that i've heard very recently um is um confidence comes with competence so you to build up the confidence um you have to start you have to make a start you have to you have to be bad to start with unfortunately that everyone starts off somewhere um and we've not all got a natural talent to do something so we have to build up that competence you know learn the skills that we need to do it whether it's making a video, whether it's doing posts on on social media, you know, whether it's doing Facebook lives, um, whether it's just starting that business or or taking that leap into that new opportunity you found in affiliate marketing or um, network marketing or e-commerce or drop shipping, whatever it is you want to you want to do, whatever it is you're looking at doing. But you, you've got to remember that you can't expect to have the confidence straight away. You need to build up the skills first. And that takes time, you know, and to, to build up those skills, um, obviously you have to do it first. You have to learn as you go. Um, and it's something that, that held me back for a long time, um, not having the confidence, not believing in myself, not believing I could do it. Um, even with the videos, I remember the first uh, video I've done, if you look back through my channel, my videos, um, you know, probably still not great, but I'm making improvements every time I do it. I'm trying to stay consistent. Um, that's another challenge that comes along with running a side hustle, something that I've talked about previously. But if you look back at my first video, I remember I was sweating like a pig. Like, you know, I was so nervous. I was sat there like 11, half 11 at night, the family all in bed. It was just me with a laptop um, and I was unbelievably nervous doing it. Um, it took me about 20 attempts before I just went sod it and I just did the video and I just posted it. I never looked back at it. I don't know how bad it is, I imagine it's pretty bad, but you've got to take that leap. And once you've done it, then after the next one was a little bit easier, the next one was a little bit easier, the next one was a bit, you know, and that's the process. that You, you build that confidence up through competence because you learn every time. And um, I've learned some software programs that I can use now to help me with um, my keyword searching on YouTube, you know, just being on video, I feel a lot more comfortable now. Um, it doesn't matter if it's to me if it's if it's not that great, as long as I'm getting some content out there and some people are finding it useful. But what you've got to do is just take that leap and just do it um, and learn on the way, you know. Um, and as you build that competence up, your confidence will come along with it. Um, I hope this really helps you out because uh, it was something that's held me back a lot, and it will still continue to hold me back. I would imagine um, as I try different different things like my Facebook lives. You know, that's something that. Um, I'm a bit nervous about doing, not because I'm worried about being on camera so much, but I'm worried about the people watching me. You know, when it's live, it's a little bit different. I've done Facebook Lives in groups before, um, and that's a little bit different. Um, but what the other thing you have to realise as well, doing something like that uh, to start with, not many people are seeing what you're doing anyway. Not many people are watching you. Um, it takes a long time um, before people actually start to watch and, and see your stuff online and by that time um, you would have built up um, a lot better uh, skills you know and you'd be a lot better at, at, the, at what you're doing so um, it's lasting long enough for people to, to find you that's what it's all about so I hope this helps um, and uh, I'll catch you next time thanks for watching bye